guys welcome back to my channel to my craft this is the third and final installment in my little april fan size haul series we're going to be unboxing one regular drill diamond painting two special shapes and some stickers so our first diamond painting is this little i don't know octopus mermaid <laughs> I just thought it's a really cute little illustration and she immediately caught my eye. This one has 23 colors and believe it or not I actually remembered my measuring tape. So let's see. She is 25 centimeters across and just about 35 from top to bottom. But we of course know fan styles usually gives you the canvas size and not the actual picture size. And along with her we got our standard toolkit, wax, little green tray and a pink pen. So our drills are all very neutral colours. But of course we could see that from the art. Only 23 colors, so I actually think this one should work up pretty quickly. Let's have a look at our canvas. So, this is that sort of thicker canvas. Printing is pretty clear, quite happy with that. Don't see any strange symbols or hard to read symbols. That is always a good thing. We've got this flimsy plastic and a very sticky canvas to work on. Now, you might notice, I don't know if you can actually see it on here, but I've got this crease in here. I'll probably just iron that out. And then next up, we have a very cute little bee. So, <laughs> I actually thought this one was a partial, so it was a nice little surprise when I saw it's actually a full draw kit. Again, we've got some nice clear printing. This is a softer, more malleable canvas. Then we have 11 different rolls. This one is a 30 by 30 canvas size, but of course we know that actually means ooh, we are working with 23 and a half and 24 centimeters okay that's interesting i thought it was a square apparently not then we have our little toolkit plastic tweezers pink pen green boat and wax and of course the important part our drills we're starting off with our background which are these clear crystals We've got some more colourful crystals, black outline, shards for the flowers, and a bunch of bigger crystals, and of course really tiny shards to drive me insane. Then we have our final diamond painting. I just got this one because I thought it was really cute. So this is our little owl. Now, again, stiff canvas, but it is board glue, so I can quickly roll it back. There you go. That helps a bit. <laughs> so, most of this is just normal crystal drills. They've got some special shapes here, and in the flowers, up here in the stars, and in the eyes. We got our standard toolkit with this one. And let's have a look at our drill. So, these are some normal black drills. Then we have some crystals. Uh, 
these are some green shards and these are like orangey yellow these are the blue crystals that go in our old eyes these are some it's almost blue almost white somewhere in between little teardrops some more teardrops some more shards Ooh, lots of blue crystals I think this will be the background and then of course we've got a bigger and a very big crystal to give us that bubble picture effect and last but not least we have some stickers now I think by now you guys know I like Harry Potter so when I saw these I simply had to have them we have a little standard toolkit so we get this sheet with nine stickers they are on a you can see here they are printed on white so they are not see-through I quite like that we've got Harry I think that's Malfoy McGonagall Hermione Dumbledore I think that's Voldemort. Then we have Ron, I think. Harry. And of course, Hagrid. So, these are all standard rolls. But that doesn't really bother me. I don't think it needs to be crystal rolls. So, we start off with black. Some white. Ooh, nice liver and green. This is brown, some red. I might change out that red though. And some yellow and some grey. Now, these don't come with DMC numbers, so I won't be keeping them. So that's our selection for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.